Hey guys, um, I'm back with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you my shift register. And uh, this shift register is, uh, you know, rather small, I'd have to say. So myself, it, um, they fit right next to each other, but they're actually um, two blo or three blocks wide, I think, each, but they fit right next to each other for, for it to be able to work. But anyways, um, yeah, let me just give you a demo. Hopefully the torches don't spaz out like they normally do. And yeah, as you see, that's what's, that's one of the bits, and it used to be there, and now it's there. So if we shift, shift all again, it will just shift that bit left. And left and left. So this is right now it has looping so that means once it gets here and you press the button again it will just go around loop right back to the front. So yeah and uh, this has an option of setting uh, whatever bit you want and you can move multiple bits. Uh, I'm not sure if that is at its prime right now because I have a full reset button right here which I was too lazy I didn't want to dig down or put any torches in fancy wiring but anyways as you see that those are all those are all like that in that formation so once I hit this button they will both shift left as you saw right there they both of the bits shift left shifted left so this does function like a shift register which the logic is in its name shifting so oh, what's this oh well doesn't really matter at, at the moment but might as well do it eh. leaves us with no harm you know Nothing will happen to us if we just go like that. Press the reset button, and those bits should go away. Okay. So yeah, and that's my shift register. Hope you guys like it. And I might leave a tutorial at the end of this video. I don't know. Probably not. If you, you guys can ask for it, it'll be kind of helpful. But anyways. That's it for today, and I'll see you guys next time.